this is Lady Jackie and welcome to my YouTube channel. Ang pag-uusapan natin ngayon ay tungkol sa RA7920. Ang RA7920 ay ang tinatawag na New Electrical Engineering Law. This is an act for a more responsive and comprehensive regulation for practice licensing and registration of electrical engineers and electricians. Article 1, Section 2, Definition of Terms. Ano nga ba yung practice of electrical engineering? 1. Consultancy, investigation, valuation, and management. Dito pumapasok yung mga engineers sa consultants. Number 2. Design and preparation of plans, specifications, and estimates of different systems. Number three, supervision of erection, installation, testing, and commissioning. Sa mga installation na siya na part. Number four, supervision of operation and maintenance of electrical equipments. Five, Supervision of manufacture and repair of electrical equipment, including switchboards, transformers, generators, etc. 6. Teaching of electrical engineering professional subjects. Uh, dito na yung mga teachers. Number 7. Taking charge of sales distributions of electrical equipment and systems. So, base dun sa definition of terms, ano nga ba yung diff different types of engineers? And then, si consultants, engineering managers, design and estimate engineers, uh, pwede din sa systems engineers, sa mga power plants, substations, industrial, etc. Dito din sa maintenance engineers, pwede din sa power plants, watercrafts, locomotives, etc. Um, QAQC engineers and service engineers, si, uh, works in factories or shops, pwede din merong safety engineers. Licensed engineers na nagi uh, na pinili maging teachers or professional teachers and sales engineers. So now, anong yung mga requirements para maging registered electrical engineers? Five rules. First, kailangan maging citizen of the Philippines or dapat maging Pilipino. Second, at least 21 years old. Kailangan good moral and or good reputation. Number four, has not been finally convicted in court or have clean record. And number five, kailangan siyempre graduate ng Bachelor of Science in Electrical Engineer. Section 18, Requirements for Registered Master Electrician, five years. Same as Registered Electrical Engineer, magkaiba lang ng education background at kailangan ng work experience. A, Citizen of the Philippines or Filipino. B. At least 18 years old. C. Good reputation with high moral values. D. Not finally convicted in court. E. Has educational background. Uh, kung 3 years electrical engineering technology yung kinuha, kailangan may 1 year work experience. Kung 2 years education or vocational ang kinuha, kailangan 2 years work experience. 1 year voc vocational yung kinuha, kailangan 3 years work experience and pwede din kahit high school graduate ka basta may 4 year work experience pwede makakuha ng registered master electrician na license so dito pumapasok yung mga ibang kurso halimbawa civil engineer siya tapos gusto lang niya maging master electrician um, gusto lang niya magkaroon ng license or mechanical engineer siya pero gusto niya magkaroon ng license sa electrical as maging master electrician Pasok siya dito as long as may, uh, as long as meron siyang experience sa electrical na 4 years. And uh, next, ano nga ba yung mga PRC exam subjects para sa mga registered electrical engineers? First, mathematics, composed of 25% algebra, calculus, trigonometry, geometry, etc. SS or engineering sciences and allied subjects. 30% nandiyan yung thermodynamics, uh, mechanics, uh, etc. <clears throat> Chemistry, physics, electrical engineering profession, 
professional subjects, 45%. And yung electrical machines, AC, DC circuits, etc. Pag nasa, uh, pag nasa examination ka na, usually it will take 3 consecutive days, 8 hours each. Para naman sa registered master electrician, PRC exam subjects. Composed of two types lang. Technical subjects, practical and computations. So, kailangan din dito ng calculators. Ohm's law, electrical machines, control equipment, machine maintenance, and repairs. Test equipments, electrical components, etc. Oh, so, hindi pa pwedeng dahil may experience ka lang. At gusto mo magkaroon ng lisensya, kukuha ka na agad. Kailangan marunong ka din sa mga technical subjects. At sa mga proper definition of terms, concepts na kailangan sa electrical. Philippine Electrical Code. Ito yung parang Bible ng electrical engineering and electricians. Kasi nandun lahat ng wiring methods, general requirements in electrical wiring installation, switch boards and panel boards, wiring diagram, etc. And code rules and regulations. Number 4. Article 4. Sundry provisions relative to electrical engineering practice. Ang sole authorized person lang to seal electrical vents ay yung professional electrical engineer. Kasi tayo lang yan sila. Yung isa yung registered master electrician, siya yung tagagawa. Si electrical engineer, siya yung taga-supervise. Si, uh, si professional electrical engineer, siya yung pinakamataas. So, siya yung nagsiseal ng mga electrical vents. REEs or Registered Electrical Engineers Charge and Supervision of Operation and Maintenance Manufacture, Teaching and Sales Si Master Electrician naman na registered for Operation, Installation, Wiring and Maintenance Pag 500 kV ampere yung mga machines under siya sa Registered Electrical Engineers Pag mga high voltages na like 600 volts or more under siya ng rep of Philippine uh, Professional Electrical Engineers Requirements for exam for Registered Electrical Engineers Kailangan meron kang PRC Regulation form Meron kang Permanent Record Card or Form 203 Number 3 ID Proof of Citizenship, Passport, Live Birth or Certificate Voters ID <coughs> Number 4 Certification of Live Birth and or Marriage Certificate if female and number five, transcript of records. Requirements for registered master electrician PRC exam. PRC application form. Permanent registration card form 203. Proof of citizenship, passport, visa, voters, ID, etc. Certificate of live birth and or marriage certificate if female. And number 5, TOR with name of course, date and graduation for SO. And last but not the least, Certificate of Affidavit of a Special Record of Practice. Signed by supervisors, trainers who are REEs.